Hello dear English learners. Today, we're going to learn how to make generalizations. Generalization is a broad statement or an idea that is applied to a group of people or things. Many people like popcorn is an example of generalization. Everybody likes popcorn is another example of generalization. Which of the two generalizations is more acceptable and valid? Yes, it is the first one. Because many people like popcorn means a lot of people like eating popcorn. When we say everybody likes popcorn, we are saying that all of us like eating popcorn, which is not true. Because some people do not like popcorn. Let's have other examples of generalizations. Some people wear glasses. Only teachers wear glasses. Which of these two generalizations is valid? That's right, it is the first one. Because not only the teachers who wear glasses. Generalizations can be valid or invalid. Generalizations are considered valid and acceptable when they use the following signal words. Some, sometimes, often, rarely, most, many, few, several. On the other hand, generalizations are invalid or not true when they use the following signal words. Always, none, all, usually, never, overall, generally, in general, everyone. Let's take a look at these two generalizations. Which one is valid and which one is not? The first generalization is valid because it is supported by facts or details. Examples from research, survey or something that really exists. It agrees with what the majority know about the topic or it is proven by several examples. The second generalization is invalid or faulty because it is not supported by facts or details. The presented examples are not enough. Activity. Give five invalid or faulty generalizations. Circle the word that makes each generalization invalid and turn them into valid generalizations. Refer to the given examples.